वेलकम टू ज्ञान एजुकेशनल इंस्टीट्यूशन वन ऑफ द रिनाउंड स्कूल इन गोहाटी माय नेम इज लूना पॉल चौधरी आई एम द क्लास टीचर ऑफ आर्ट्स सेक्शन आई एम टीचिंग इकोनॉमिक्स इकोनॉमिक्स इज ए पार्ट ऑफ सोशल साइंस इकोनॉमिक्स is the study of economic problems due to limited resources in relation to unlimited wants economics is mainly divided into two parts microeconomics and macroeconomics microeconomics is the study of individual units like farms household consumer behavior producer behavior etc and macroeconomics is the study of whole like aggregate investment national income aggregate demand aggregate supply etc in high secondary your economics subject it is divided into four parts in class 11 you will study microeconomics and statistics and in class 12 you will study macroeconomics and indian economic development so i hope my dear students you will cooperate with me and all the teachers of arts section now all the teachers will give their introduction and syllabus of the subjects thank you and this 
a subject which is really very really interesting affairs it is not a subject that only the theoretical part you will come to know it is a subject where case study is related it is a subject where you can apply see the pandemic situation we are dealing with the lockdown phase 1 phase 2 to phase 5 okay these are also related to our constitution do you want to know how come take my subject i love my subject with heart and soul hello students myself trishna devi your entrepreneurship teacher so here i am going to give you a brief explanation about the subject entrepreneurship so what is entrepreneurship first of all you have to know entrepreneurship it is a very interesting subject as it is related to starting up a new business okay how you will start a new business with your creativity with your innovative skill that is all about entrepreneurship so uh, in this subject uh, the total marks about the syllabus uh, i am going to say uh, syllabus uh, total marks will be 100 then uh, in 100 marks 70 marks you will get theory paper and other 30 marks you have to make it practical okay in practical you have to do some projects that projects will be related to market survey you have to do market research uh, about customers needs wants all these things you have to make a project and about business plan business plan means how you will start your own business with your creativity how much investment you will do all these things about all these things you have to make a project it is good that here uh, 30 marks you will get practical okay only 70 marks theory so it is the subject is very much scoring also um, and interesting also hello students i am bhakti bhosho your sociology teacher here i am going to give you a brief description for the subject sociology okay this subject is very interesting and also very scoring most of the questions are based on your understanding simply speaking sociology is the scientific study of our society it is a connection between our personal problems and public issues now all the students always like this subject because these are the problems here we deal with the problems which we usually suffer every day in our life okay overall we can say that sociology is a hot spot of different social sciences sociology can be called the mother of social sciences children okay because it goes into the matter and study it properly hello students i am itali padhyay your physical education teacher today i am here to introduce the subject physical education which is very important for our 11 and 12 classes hmm. uh, this is a compulsory subject for all streams because it is having more uh, benefits for uh, scoring marks it is a very much scoring subject you can get a very good score uh, in your finals so what is physical education physical education is a subject uh, which deals with all the subject uh, uh of our general education means it is a part of general education uh, so physical education is a subject by which we can get wholesome development of a person it includes um uh, uh, chemistry biology physics sociology physiology psychology uh, biomechanics and kinesiology some uh, uh, yogas are there and food and nutrition doping uh, and the sports 156 game, games are there uh, uh, which you have to learn and you have to practice uh, this is a theoretical and practical both the classes are here uh, you can have uh, more opportunities uh, by uh, Uh, this subject huh? with the help of this subject you can have more benefits in your future uh, in your career also you can um, means uh, you can get many more benefits from this subject hello student i'm lubamudra bhattacharya and i teach geography in indian education institution guwahati 
geography as you have studied so far as a part of social sciences in class 9, 10 and other junior classes. Here you will take geography as one of your optional subjects and which is very scoring. It is very interesting to study geography in class 11 and 12 which you will find it quite different from what we have studied and in the junior classes. Now we will study about the formation of landforms, mountain, plateau and plain. Next we will find the formation of the atmosphere, atmospheric gases, the layers of atmosphere, the composition of atmosphere, the pollution, everything. Then we will study about the hydrosphere, the ocean, the surface under the ocean, type of landforms under the ocean, the chemical composition of water and the movement of water from North Pole to South Pole and from Equator, so circulation of water. Then we will study about the lithosphere, hydrosphere, atmosphere and then biosphere, conservation of the earth, conservation of wildlife. The second book consists of India paper. We will study everything about India. We will study about the political boundary, physical boundary. We will talk about Himalayas. We will talk about Ganges, the major rivers. We will talk about the soil. We will talk about the ocean. We will talk about the climate, forest, and everything about India. Hello students, I am Bishal De and today I am going to talk about information practice or IP in short. Uh, so this IP is a subject of CBSE curriculum uh, for 11 and 12 for commerce and arts stream specially. So you may ask that why we required IP as a subject as we will be studying commerce or arts. That has nothing to do with computer you will say but let me tell you that no matter which stream you study, what profession you choose, a computer is an integral part of it. You can be a charter accountant, company secretary or accountant or professor or any other domain. Computer is an essential part of it and without that you can't achieve success in that particular field or you cannot you can't have edge over your counterpart without using technology. CBC has given the computer subject as a class 11 and 12 students also so that they can uh, they can search other domains for their job not only that uh, related to your you know, like chatter accountant or cost uh, company secretary or cost accountant or professor or any other lines so this is a one domain where you can excel if you have proper knowledge so 11 12 is just basic of that particular profession or domain so i hope uh, you will understand much better 